Hey guys, it's Mason. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm doing a smoky eye tutorial with my new Naked Urban Decay Smoky Palette. I'm so excited. I got this for my birthday and I'm really excited to use it. Also, we just hit 200 subscribers. Thank you guys so much. Oh my god, I can't believe this is real life. I know 200 doesn't seem like a lot, but it's a big deal to me. Um, yeah, thank you guys so much. If you enjoyed this video, please make sure to subscribe down below. And maybe let's get it to 250, maybe three. I'm not gonna go there. 250. Let's try for 250. Yes, make sure you subscribe down below and give this video a thumbs up. Okay, now let's just get into the video. All right, so I'm going to start off with brows today. For brows today, I'm just gonna go in with the Maybelline Brow Precise Brow Pencil. I'm just going to fill in my brows, and yeah, I will be right back with that. All right, so now once my brows are done, I know I haven't been going for like a real Instagram bold brow lately. I've just been going with the like natural, but like a little subtle brow, so yeah. And I'm just going to set it all in place with the e.l.f. waxing stick. All right, so once my waxing stick is all in there, I'm just gonna take the spoolie of this and just put all the hairs in my eyebrows in place, just like that, to make sure that they are all in place where I want them to go. And that's it. All right, so now once my brows are done, I'm just gonna head on in with the eyes. And today I'm using the Urban Decay Naked Smoky Eye Palette. I'm really excited. This can be like my first official look with this because I've used these two colors before, like, what are their names? 13 and Combust, just to like make my eyes like less shiny and stuff. So, yeah. Speaking of making my eyes less oily and shiny, I'm going to take some primer, primer. I'm going to take some concealer. I'm going to put it on my eyelids so they can be prepped and ready. <laughs> Alright, so once my concealer is all on there, I'm just going to take my concealer brush and I'm just going to blend that all out on my eyelid. Alright, so now we're just going to do the same thing on the other eye and just blend out all this concealer with my concealer brush. Alright, now to set all of that, I'm just going to go in with my Rimmel Stay Matte Powder in the shade Sandstorm and just matte that all down. And the brush that I use for that is just this little e.l.f. brush. It, this doesn't have a name either, but it's just like a little fluffy e.l.f. brush. Alright, so let's just get into the eyeshadow. And I normally just use the brush that it comes with. And then I just normally blend out with the e.l.f. brush. So that's what I'm going to do. So first, I'm just going to take Combust. And I'm just going to take that on the fluffy side of this brush and just put that all over my lid. Alright, so now once that is all over my eye, I'm just going to go in with a little bit of Password, which is like a gray color right here. I'm just going to put that in my crease. Alright, so now once that is all blended out, I'm going in with the small side of the brush. And I'm just going to go in with Whiskey, and that's like a brown shade right here. And that is going in the outer portion of my crease and the outer V of my eye. And I'm just going to take the fluffy side of this brush and I'm just going to blend that out. Alright, so now once this brown is all blended out, I'm going back in with Password, which is that gray color. And I'm putting that on the fluffy side of the brush and I'm putting that on the middle to outer portion of my lid. Alright, so once that is all blended out, I'm going in with a little bit of Radar, which is this medium gold shade that's sparkly and with this flat... Morphe brush. So I'm going to be taking radar on my brush. I'm just going to be putting that on the inner portion of my lid. Then I'm going to be going in with a little bit of Dirty Sweet, which is this really gold shade right here on the same flat brush. I'm just going to take a little bit of Dirty, ooh, that's really pigmented. Go with Dirty Sweet and put that on even in a portion of my lid. Then on the very, very inner corner, I'm going to take high, which is this champagne color, and the 
small part, small side of the brush. I'm just gonna be putting that in my inner corner. All right, so the eye look is done. All I need is just eyeliner, but my eyeliner ran out. What I would normally do is I would take my 35 B palette from Morphe and take this black shade all the way down here and with an angle brush and I would do a liner. So that's what I'm going to do today. So I'm just going to go in that black shade. I'm just going to first sketch out where I want the wing to go. That's a good place for a wing and then I'm just going to normally go from the point and just go down. All right, so that wing came out good. Let me see. Yeah, that wing came out good, so I'm just gonna do the same exact thing on this eye. Great, now my wings are done, and I'm glad that they came out symmetrical, which is always a good. All right, so now for the lower lash line, I'm just gonna go in with Password again, and I'm just going to put that on my lower lash line. Then I'm going to be taking a little bit of Whiskey, which is that brown shade on the small side of this brush, and put that on the outer portion of my lower lash line. Then blending all that out with the fluffy side of this brush. Alright, so all the eyeshadow is finished. Now I'm just going to go in with my eyelash curler and curl my lashes. Now that my right eye lashes are all curled, I'm just going to go in with the Maybelline New York Falsies Vitamin Express Waterproof Mascara and just coat my lashes with this. And I'm also going to take this mascara and put it on my bottom lashes. Alright, so now I'm just going to do the same thing on my other eye. Alright, now my eyes are complete. So for my face makeup, I'm just going to keep it light and simple because it is summer and you don't want like boom boom stuff on your face because like normally like it's the sun and the heat and everything so today I'm just gonna go in with a little bit of concealer so I'm just going to take my concealer and I'm just going to push that up onto the brush let me take my mirror I'm just going to put this under my eyes I'm gonna put it down the bridge of my nose and on my forehead and also on my chin and on my smile lines. And I'm just now realizing that I did not put on primer. So after this video, I'm just gonna have to rush and take this off. <laughs> so <laughs> that saying, I'm going to blend all this out with my little beauty sponge thing, so yeah. Okay, so my camera actually died on me, so I just charged it for about seven minutes, I think. So I need to hurry this up. Okay, so once I was done blending out my concealer, I just took my Rimmel Stay Matte Powder in the shade Sandstorm, and I just set my whole entire face. Now I'm going to go in with my Icing Instant Bronzer, and I'm just going to put that in my cheekbones and in my temples. Alright, so now once I have all my bronzer on, or, yeah, bronzer, I'm going to take my... Tarte blush in the shade Parte. I'm gonna take this white fluffy brush. I'm just going to put that on the apples and outer of my cheeks All right, so now once that is over I'm going to go in with my Anastasia Beverly Hills Nicole Garou glow kit I'm gonna go in with forever young and put that on my cheekbones today and I'm gonna be using this fan brush from Morphe. I'm also gonna put this on my nose And my cupid bow Alright, so now once all that is done, all I have left is lips. I'm just going to go in with this Tarte Tartist Lip Paint in the shade, if I can find it, Birthday Suit, and I'm just going to put that all over my lips. Alright, this lip color is super, super pretty. It's my first time using it, and it smells like peppermint and super, super good. And now this look is complete. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe down below and comment what has been your favorite makeup look that I've done on my channel. Thank you guys so much for subscribing. I just hit 200 subscribers. I'm so excited about that. And yeah, I will see y'all all next video because I don't really have a schedule anymore because I post Wednesday last time. I don't know when I'm posting this. But yeah, I will see y'all all next time I post a video. Peace out. in New York bow